According to the NCAA, less than 3% of high school football players go on to play Division I football, but that statistic didn't stop unheralded high school football prospect Jeremy Mercer from chasing his dreams and making a D1 roster. This is Jeremy Mercer's journey to Division I football. Jeremy Mercer always dreamed of playing professional football, but he never got the opportunity to showcase his talents until his senior year at Basha High School. In his final and only year playing on varsity, Mercer played at cornerback, and he was a dynamic defensive back that could make big hits whenever necessary. Unfortunately, his film didn't seem to gain the attention of many scouts. I wasn't, I wasn't receiving any um, interest from any Division I level schools. I had, I had small communication with um, NAU, Northern Arizona. But other than that, especially the Arizona schools, I, even after this year, they, they didn't talk to me. So, Even with the lack of offers from college recruits, Mercer wasn't going to let this stop him from pursuing his goal of playing professional football. No, no one was really giving me looks, but I, I always knew what I wanted to do, and I wasn't going to let that stop me. So I ended up walking on to MCC, Mesa Community College. Things were looking up for the young prospect as he received another shot at playing the game he loved, but his first two seasons didn't go according to plan. Got there for fall camp, and then one of the first days in fall camp, I um, ended up tearing my shoulder, my labrum. So I had to sit out that season. And then the next season, I was like fighting for a starting spot, right? And um, then we got word that the program was getting shut down after that last year. Due to financial burdens, all Arizona community college football programs were canceled after the 2018 season. Thankfully, a new JUCO league was created by former community college coaches, and Mercer joined the league and became a member of the Gila River Hawks, giving himself another chance to show off his skills. In his first season as a player for Gila River, Mercer was moved from his typical defensive back role to more of an outside linebacker role, and he quickly turned into one of the best defensive players in the newly formed JUCO league. Yeah, I've just always kind of been like that, just ball hawks. I just see ball, get ball, you know, so um, the opportunity to make a play, I'm going to go take it. So, At the end of Mercer's breakout campaign in the 2019 season, he received offers from Utah and Utah State. After much consideration, Mercer decided to take his talents to the University of Utah. Um, I just I just felt like Utah was a spot for me, and I knew. I, I prayed about it, and I thought about it a lot with myself and talked with my family a lot, too, also. But um, I've always told myself I was going to play big-time football, Pac-12 football. In his first season at Utah, Mercer was expected to play the same outside linebacker position he was used to while at Gila River. Regardless of how he's utilized, Mercer boasts a unique skill set that he is looking forward to improve upon in the upcoming season. I've been a DB my entire life, so I know coverages and stuff like that, and I'm just getting into this linebacker stuff, and it, it's been a blast so far, so it'll be good. With two years of eligibility remaining, Mercer will have plenty of time to make some noise at Utah and continue his remarkable football journey.